So, uh, still cramping users. So, uh, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use uh, this program, how to start the program. Uh, after you place your order, you'll get email from me. In that email, there you will get your username and login password. And also, there's a link in that email. It's this link. Okay, click on that link. It will direct you to this page. All right. So, the new user still cramping design new user page. Okay. Uh, before doing anything, so you need a web browser. Uh, we specify the Microsoft Edge web browser. It's a built-in web browser for Windows uh, system, Windows operating system, and it's free and it's built-in. Okay, so you can specify Microsoft Edge as your default web browser on your computers. Okay, so and then click on go to this page, click on start the program. This will direct you to the main page of Cranbin Design. There are two design codes. One is American AIC code, one is Canadian code. Okay. I assume you are American user, so click on this link, it will direct you to the uh, AIC code design page. Okay. Then that's the login. Okay. I, I will specify one more time. Okay. So now when you get a page, it's a guest. Okay. It shows as guest. You click on the login button here, login link here. Okay, so um, key in the username and password you get uh, in your email. Okay, and uh, and do a math here. Log in. Okay, so after you log in, you will find the, the username uh, change from guest to your username. Okay, so now. Uh, let me do a quick tour of this uh, user interface. These brown color cells uh, uh, are the, your input cell, okay? So, and uh, there's two T here. So, we have two T switch here, okay? If you click on, I mean, when you first get here, get this page, it's on. The two T is turned on, okay? That means when you move your mouse over to some, uh, most of the cell, you'll get the pull uh, out the uh, online user manual tips, okay? And uh, you move here, move here, say here, move here, you will get a uh, uh, pop-up uh, explanation on what this uh, sales input is about, okay? So basically, you explain to you every, most, almost every step, what this input, and uh, what should you should input, and explain in details. Okay, that's two tips. Uh, once you get familiar with all these uh, input values, um, the, you can turn this 2T off, okay? So after that, when you move your mouse over, it will not show the pop-up. That's two tip, okay? And uh, then after you, you can input, start input here, everything here, and then you get your result here. First one is a low calculation. Click on this link, you will start a new window, okay? Uh, a detailed calculation on the low calculation. Cram low and close this one and click on this link. You will go to uh, the steel clamping design page. Okay, a detailed page. Close this page. So, uh, this is the main page for input. These two links direct you to the low calculation and the steel clamping design calculation. Okay, you can print these uh, different three pages separately. Okay. So that's the design result, okay? One more thing is uh, how to save, how to open the previous file. Okay, move your mouse to uh, the right area of this page. Right-click your mouse, let's pull up here, okay? So there's a save, low input, okay? Save input file, you put uh, key in uh, uh, my first input, my first input, okay? IMPUT, my first input. You click on save, and here, okay, you move here, go to the folder here, okay, show in folder, okay, that's your, how to say that, that's your download folder. On your, on your download folders, that's my first input, that's your input file, okay, so move this up. And close it so you can access your save file by move here, move mouse here, go to folder. Okay, I uh, close this guy, go to folders. Okay, you open up this file. Okay, 
So close this one and want to load your previous uh, design file. Right click your mouse here, load input file, and browse to download folders. Okay, my first input can load this file successfully. Okay, close it. So that's how you save a file, load a previous save file. Okay, and the the rest uh, you can check it out. Okay, tend to the all. And the last things I like to show you how to print it. Okay, so uh. Go to that's input file. You want to print the input file? Okay. Go to here. Go to print. Okay. And uh, make sure you select Microsoft Print to PDF. That's a built-in uh, uh, PDF printer from Microsoft uh, Edge web browser. Okay. Use this one. Microsoft Print to PDF. And uh, go to more settings here. Make sure the background graphics and header and footer is checked. Okay, then click on print button. Uh, my first print, my first print. Okay, you print uh, your your first print to uh, 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 my first print. Okay, you print your calculation here. PDF file, okay. From PDF, you can print to any physical printer, okay. So that's how to print, okay. And uh, no, not this page, okay. Not this page. It's this page, okay. Then I'll show you how to print the low calculation. You click on this link, okay. Click on this link. That's your low calculation with a diagram chart showing here, a steel frame chart here. Okay, you want to print this one? Okay, so go to here, click on print. Okay, it's uh, Microsoft Print PDF. Okay, here and the more setting. I think these two background graphics and header and footer are checked. You only need to set this up once, I believe. They will stay. Okay, and you don't need to uh, 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 do it every time. Okay. So Microsoft print PDF print and uh, my second my second print okay save and go to uh, download folders my second print all right so uh, hundred twenty five okay so these are uh, PDF file. You'll print out okay, so uh, that's how to print. Okay, close this one. Okay, so I think uh, that's it. Uh, that's how to use uh, our program. All right, thank you, and see you next.